two murders in two Kentucky counties. And tonight, say police need your help finding two men they say are connected to both of them. They say that 36-year-old Eugene Wade Jr. and 24-year-old Devontae Hall are wanted for the murders. Police say over the weekend, Devin Payton was found dead in Montgomery County and Brandy Davidson was found dead in Wolf County. New tonight, Monique Blair talked to Davidson's parents. It's our top story at 11. It's horrible. I mean, I mean, think about it. I mean, Brandy was beautiful, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and now she's gone. We'll never see her again. Through tears, Gary Sell talked about his daughter, Brandy Davidson, saying she was a joy to be around, someone who never met a stranger. And he believes she was just in the wrong place at the wrong time when she was shot and killed over the weekend. To my understanding, they shot her in the back, they shot her twice in the head. We're going to have to have a closed casket now. I'll never get to say goodbye to her again. Brandy spent several years growing up here in Powell County, and now her family, who still lives here in Powell County, tells me one of the most difficult things of losing Brandy is that now her three very young children will grow up without their mother. No matter how many pictures you show a kid, they're not going to know their mother. I mean, a picture's not mommy. But it's not only her children who will feel the void. I've lost, I've lost my daughter. Nothing can bring back your daughter. Nothing. Brandy's family has set up a GoFundMe account to help pay for funeral expenses. And anything left over will go into a college fund for her children. It would be a, a tragic not, not to be able to bury our daughter right. You know what I'm saying? Our daughter meant the world to us. In Powell County, Monique Blair, WKYT. And you can find a link to that GoFundMe site at WKYT.com. Police have not said what they think led to the double murder.